on, Coop! This game is boring. Plus, Coop never throws me the ball. Like you could even handle the heat I'm throwing, Millie. Come on, Coop. Throw the ball to your sister. Fine. Here's something you could handle. <laughs> Nice throw. Wow! What an arm! Get the ball, will you, son? But she, she. No, no, it's Coop's fault. Oh, I can't get the ball. Dumb sister. Oh, just kidding. Oh, oh this is just fun. I'm missing. My shoe. Thanks a lot, Millie. <coughs> there you are. Honey, he must belong to someone. Yeah, someone with really bad eyesight. <laughs> Sorry, Millie, but we can't keep him. Her, or it. We've got to find the owner. <laughs> all right, all right. If we can't find his owner, we'll keep him. Thanks, Daddy. And here's your ball. <laughs> My Knockleyville Cheddar Teaser sign consolation round baseball! I didn't even think about it, son. Well, what about my ball? I gotta get it back! You know darn well that whatever or whoever enters old Lady Munson's yard is never seen again. And I really don't feel like dealing with her today. Ugh. Hold still, kitty. There! Don't you look precious? You must be so hungry. <laughs> better. Ugh. I've made enough posters to cover the whole neighborhood. I've decided that I'm going to call him Mr. Cat. Great name. Well, don't get too comfortable, Mr. Cat. I'm going to find your owner. Maybe Mr. Cat and I could help. Uh, sure. Goody! Come on, Mr. Cat! There! It worked! Finally, we're gonna get rid of that bald squirrel! Did you find my kitty? <laughs> we sure did! <laughs> Too bad. So sad. You found a cat? My dog is hungry. Try to swallow him whole. Sorry, son. I guess this means we'll be keeping Mr. Cat. Goody! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Daddy. I can build a care of him, I'll feed him and wash him and see him and paint him. And... <sighs> I think I need something for my ears. That cat is so out of here. <laughs> Let's see who you belong to, Mr. Cat. Whoa, this is one weird collar. Uh-oh. 
you've really got it out for this cat, don't you, Coop? Why would you even think of blowing up his collar? And where'd you get the fireworks to do it? Ugh, I told you, Dad, it blew up by itself. Yeah, just finish cleaning up your mess and try to stay out of trouble. Uh, cat! Goodbye, Growler! What have we got here? <laughs> Quickly, boy. Oh, man. Now my lucky baseball is gone, too. <laughs> ah, so that's where she keeps all the stuff. Mr. Cat, the wild garden gnome is ferocious when startled. But Big Brothers are a whole nother story. Holy moly! Thief! Thief! Move it! Oh, hello, Millie. Who do we have here? Hello, Mrs. Munson. Would you like to meet Mr. Cat? Oh, well, well. <laughs> Mr. Cat is very nice indeed. Too bad I can't say the same about your nasty brother. Alone, they're bad enough. Together, a guy doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> Can't draw. He's a cat. <laughs> That's no cat. It's some kind of alien. Coop! First, you blow a crater in the backyard. Then you sneak into Old Lady Monson's yard. And now this. <sighs> I never thought I'd say this, Coop. But go to your room. <sighs> what do you think, Growler? Perhaps Aloysius would enjoy some sun today. No, that won't do. He and Sir Scratch are up aren't speaking. Maybe he should visit with Tom Tuttle. <gasps> Tom Tuttle's is gone. <laughs> back in, back in! Is your brother up yet? Sourpuss is still asleep. Well, I hope he's had time to think about... I'll get it. Billy! No! There you are, Mr. Cap. What have you been up to? Your juvenile delinquent son stole all of my confiscated toys and kidnapped Tom Tuttles! Coop wouldn't do a thing like that. I followed his footprints! Oh, but those are all left feet. We'll sniff him out, won't we, Growler? Tom Tuttles! Where are you, Tom Tuttles? Tom Tuttles? Uh, what the? Coop! You can't hide from... Coop, are you... What are... Why? I didn't do this, I swear. Where are the toys you stole from my shed? What? I didn't steal anything from your shed. Um... <laughs> Tom Tuttles! A toy thief! And a gnome napper! I'll deal with you later. I, I, I'm sure it's just a maze he's going through. <laughs> Daddy's gonna give you up for adoption. You! I don't know how you set me up, but... My 
shoe! So that's the way you want to play it, huh? Well, I'm ready for anything, Cat. You'll be sorry you missed me with that rock! Um, isn't anyone gonna get me down from here? Anyone? Anyone see my book report? It's due today and I can't find it! Such a good idea. Oh. I'm not kidding, Dennis. Ever since that cat moved in, my whole life has been turned upside down. Lauren, Harley, what are you guys doing? Making our own horror movie? The, the Suburban, suburban Weed Whacker Massacre! massacre. <laughs> We're transforming the face of contemporary horror. Yeah, it's gonna be wicked awesome! We're sending it to Ghastly Graves. He'll put it on his TV show for sure. <laughs> what you trying to say? I can't hear you. Who's Ghastly Graves? Ghastly Graves, the host of Ghost Castle, the scariest show ever. It's on every night at midnight. Or is that too late for you babies? <laughs> Unless you're scared. Watch it tonight, Channel 9, Midnight. We're not scared of anything. Yeah, except spiders. Um, the dark, Old Lady Munson, candy apples, werewolves, double-decker buses, uh, sometimes aardvarks. Oh, I don't think I can sit through this, Coop. Dennis, if we don't watch the movie tonight, Lauren and Harley will know we chickened out. <laughs> Tune in tonight, viewers, for the Ghoulish Gala, Channel 9. <laughs> Yeesh, it's just a commercial. She's right. We can do this, Dennis. You can vote for tonight's creature feature. Will it be zombie cat flesh eaters? <coughs> Attack of the Mega Leeches? <coughs> or Vampire Roller Derby? None of the above! I think I hear my mother calling Pop-Up! See you, Dennis! Call 555-0100! Right now! I can do this! I can do this! Each call costs 75 cents, and you can vote as many times as you like! Be sure to call in right away, viewers! There's only five more hours to vote! Five hours from now? Isn't that um? The middle of the night? Dad will let me stay up. Uh-uh. It's a school night. Dad won't let you stay up to watch some dumb movie. Oh, yeah? We'll see what he says when I use my powers of persuasion. No. But... It's past your bedtime. But... You have school in the morning. But... And scary movies give you nightmares. Did I forget anything? No. Told you so. All the votes have been counted. It's a landslide win with over 96,000 calls for tonight's ghoulish gala. Zombie cat flesh eaters. <laughs> Quiet. Well, I suppose you can clean out Mr. Cat's litter box for a month and your Fun Station 2000. No Fun Station! My Captain Blastroid action figure? Three weeks of litter box duty. Two weeks! Two weeks, three days, and 12 hours, or I scream for dead. 
Deal! Okay, enjoy your bad dreams. Come on, Mr. Cat. It's time for bed. It's a wonder he can get any sleep after you made him watch that creepy show. He's been here all night? Of course he has. that horror movie, didn't you? <laughs> I called what number? 96,840 times? It's how much per call? I'll get it! Hey, Dennis, would you? <laughs> Look, it's
it's Zombie Cat Boy himself. What's going on? Great performance last night, Coop. Better than the movie, even. Huh? Check it out. Huh? Zombie Cat! Zombie Cat! Zombie Cat! Ah, ah. Oh, zombie Cat! Ah. That cat is going down. <laughs> Coop, what did you do to Mr. Cat last night? He's all dusty. <laughs> You're right, Millie. Cat is dusty. Why don't you give him a bath? <gasps> Good idea, Coop. <laughs> this will fix you right up, Mr. Cat. <laughs> Look who's the scaredy cat now! 